Hello everyone, my name is Sumit and I welcome all of you to BISP Self Learning Bureau Broadcast Solution. Today I am going to tell you about Mail Merge template and Mail Merge features in Dynamics CRM. So we have talked about what to do with Microsoft Dynamics CRM when you have to type the same email over and over. So that problem we have solved by using the creating email template. But what about a letter if you have to send a similar letter to leads or to contacts or to accounts and you have to send those letter, those letters frequently so the easiest way to generate and distribute that letter while utilizing your data in CRM is to use a mail merge template now we can use mail merge template with Microsoft Office Word to create custom ready letter faxes email messages and quotes Microsoft Office Word templates are created and edited in Microsoft Office Word but can be uploaded to Microsoft Dynamics CRM to use with mail merge and share with other users as well. And only the documents whose extension with .xml can be used as a template. So let's create a let's see how to create a mail merge template in Dynamics CRM and how to customize a template, how to configure it, and then how to upload back it to the CRM. So for this, let's switch to CRM. So I've already switched to CRM here and I would like to create a mail merge template for contacts so I select sales and contact and then I look for advanced find here I click on advanced find in this advanced find I'm going to look for all the open contacts or active contacts and then I would like to send a email or a letter to all of them so I look for contact so I select here contacts and status equals to active and okay and when I search the result so we can see the records here so I look for the records and click on mail merge so I click on mail merge and in this mail merge I want to create a blank document first and my requirement that I, have, I want to create a letter which I need to send all the contacts so I create a blank contact and click on downloads so it will download a mail merge document on my desktop on my system it's, it has downloaded now I'm going to customize it so I'll open it and then to customization in order to do the customization first of all I need to click on enable editing then I click on enable content and after that in view in, on add-ins there is a CRM tab so I click on CRM and this CRM will help me to do the mail merge now next step is mail merge recipient so who will be the mail merge recipient so if you want to include all of them right now so you can include them else you can simply click on ok you can uncheck them all and you can click on ok so I click on ok and first requirement is I want to add an address box address block so I click on address block okay after that this block I want a greeting line so that is greeting line then I write here dear and the name of that person so the name of that particular contact I click on insert field and contact first full name or contact first name or last name so I go with full name thanks for showing interest in our product our representative will contact you soon regards team here so here we can create a complete letter so I have mentioned I have write only a single line but you can go with multiple lines in a complete letter or an email or a fax and once it is done 
I need to click on preview your letter. That's how it looks like. It looks like this. And uh, then I'll click on complete the merge. So once the merge is completed, either we can directly print out it from here. But right now, we don't have any names and all. So I'm going to save this first of all. So I click on save and save as and make sure that the document which you are sending that should be in .xml format. If that if it is not in XML format, we cannot upload it back onto CRM. So I'll go with this one 40455 and it should be saved on my desktop, but it should be in XML document format. So I click on save. So the document has been saved successfully. So once it is saved successfully, now I'm going to launch the mail merge. So to launch mail merge, close it. I go to settings, templates, and in templates, we have got mail merge template. So it says that upload and manage world template for use with mail merge. So I click on that template, mail merge template. So this mail merge template opens. I'm going to create a new mail merge template here. And that mail, the name of that mail merge template, which I'm going to upload is, if I give a name here, uh, the name is, let's suppose, uh, contact meeting letter template. Associated entity will be contact. Ownership is individual. Owner is this one, template language is English, and I'm going to upload that file. So I click on choose file and look for that particular file. So the name, that file is mail merge 40455. So I look for that and I add that file to desktop, mail merge. This is an XML document, this is what document. So I select the XML document and open it. And once it is done, I save and close this. Okay, so first of all, we need to attach it. So once it is attached, I click on save and close. Now I'm going to send, now my requirement is that I have to send an email or I have to send a letter to all the, all of my contacts. So again, I click on sales, contact, and I would like to send emails to all of them. So I quickly look for the records. I quickly search the records, whose status is active or according to a requirement, based on a requirement. So contacts and owner equals to current user. Look, search for result. And I would like to send letters to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 users, 10 contacts. So I select all of them. Then I click on mail merge and in mail merge, the mail merge template which we have uploaded just now. So I look for organization mail merge template and here I'll get the mail merge template. Sorry, it has gone into personal mail merge template. So you can see contact mailing letter template. So I select it and click on download. Again, it will download a letter for me. So I click on save and when I open that document, Enable editing. And you can see here, these are, the, these are the contacts which we selected while loading this, download, while downloading this mail merge template. So, so I click on OK. And as soon as I click on OK, again, I'm, I've got an option here, preview your letter. So we click on preview the letter. And you can see the address and the names are coming automatically and we can check the recipient, second, third, fourth, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 10, because we have selected 10, 10 contacts over there. So we have got 10, let, 10 letters. And from here, we can directly make a printout or we'll look, we'll send a printout directly from here itself. So I click on complete the merge and we can directly print. So I click on print all or current record or from a specific one to 10 or it as per the requirement. And when I click on all, the, it will be directly sent to the printer. So like this, we can work on a mail merge and we can create a mail merge template in dynamic CRM and then we can do the mail merge. We can, we can use mail merge for sending letters, faxes, quotations to our customers, to our clients.
that's all in this video if you have any queries if you have any questions you can visit our website www.bispsolutions.com or you can subscribe our youtube channel for more videos and we provide customized training on dynamic crm developer training as well as the customization training as well and we'll help in all aspects to our clients have a nice day ahead goodbye